we built the stand around visuality, we built it around visual learning. And mixed age learning, we've had young children working with older children. Two of the projects, one they've been looking at the, um, the transition between primary and secondary school, which is a big problem for us, I know it's a problem for you too. And, um, they've been talking to other children around the world about that problem. Uh, they, this morning they talked to a school in Cornwall, very, very different to a London school, a little tiny fishing village. Um, on Friday they're talking to a school in Queensland, where the floods, as you know, have been very bad. So, of course, it's summer in Queensland, so there the children, as primary children, have stopped being primary children. Then their town has been flooded, now they're about to start as secondary children. So, that transition problem will be, will be very interesting. And I love the way that children can just dial out to other schools and chat casually to them. Over, over the years we've been doing this, thing, they've become very, very relaxed. The sound's been exciting. Um, we've had children doing a sound escape for bed. They've been going around using their um, iPhones and iPads to capture the decibel levels all over the show. And they have a, they have a stand and they're writing their sound levels on it, covering it to show which is that. Data visualization, I think, is a very important skill now for children. And then they're looking at the hotspots and saying, very quiet, very loud, going back and looking at the design features around that part of the show and saying, why is this a noisy part? Why is this a quiet part? So it's really, really quite interesting. Um, so this year in particular, we've had a lot of children going around the show doing work and maybe less, maybe less time on the stand. So I guess I could spend, as you know, probably a month telling you about different things, but I think the best thing is for you to ask me questions and I'll pick things to show you, like this school library in Australia behind me. And um, so ask me any question really about, about learning and where learning's going. I'll try and find some things to illustrate. And we've got, we've got plenty of time to do that. So um, who, would like to, who would like to ask the first question?